Hello, everybody. Are you having trouble finding what you need in our databases? Are the required limits in your assignment bringing you to results of zero? There may be another way to get at useful articles. You can call this method of searching backwards searching if you want. In the days before everything was online and in computers, yes, I just dated myself. When you were doing research in journals, there were directories and guides. They are all now online. That were basically a printed out keyword search. You would look up keywords in the guide and it would tell you in which journal you should be looking for an article and the title and page numbers and so you could find it. Many of these guides also had subject and article titles listed by journal too. Helpful different colored paper sections. This lets you look up a journal title and see what subjects it covered and the articles in it. The second way of searching does still exist in the computer age, minus the colored paper. It is just a little trickier to find. Pick your database. And usually at the top of the screen, you will see a publications tab. This will bring you to a screen where you can search for journal by title, such as online journal of rural nursing and healthcare. Once you find a journal, just click on the title. ESCO databases will make you click on the search within this publication link before you can search. ProQuest databases just gives you a search box right in the publication screen. All the normal limiters, full text, period, etc will also appear on your search results page to help you limit your results down if needed. Now, you're probably wondering why I'm showing you all this kind of backwards way of searching. Well, it turns out a perfectly relevant article to your search terms may not show up. Sometimes none show up, even though they exist. Databases are not perfect. Neither are search box algorithms. Math that makes them work. As an example, I recently helped a student search for a topic and we kept getting zero results topic is a common sense everyday topic and should have had plenty of articles but we only ever got zero when trying normal and even advanced searching then i tried searching from inside a relevant journal publication and instead presto suddenly 96 articles showed up for some reason the search just did not work for this topic but the search inside the publication did this is not normally necessary but it is a helpful bit of old school thinking that's still useful today so remember if you get stuck, try working the problems backwards because you never know what new perspective will give you. And as always, feel free to contact the Learning Commons staff for any help you may need. That's all for now. See you next time.